Hey guys, it's Kai from GBR, and today I wanna to talk to you about buying a car. Now, not only am I gonna explain it in five easy tips, but I'm also going to do it in 90 seconds. Now, I've already gotta run some errands today, so why don't we just do this in the car? Let's go. All right, start the clock. So tip number one is set a budget. Setting a budget is probably one of the most difficult things to do, especially when your expectations look like this, but your wallet looks more like this. Now the rule of thumb is that you should not spend more than 15% of your net pay on your car payment. And just keep in mind that the larger your down payment is, the smaller your monthly payment will be. Tip number two, research your options. Before you start contacting private sellers or visiting car dealerships, you really wanna get an idea of what's out there. So take a look at some car review websites or even visit some used car dealerships. Tip number three, determine how you'll pay for the car. If you plan on financing your car, make sure you get pre-approved for your car loan prior to going to the dealership. Now the best place to start looking for a car loan is gonna be your local credit union because they usually offer the lowest rates. And if you do have a car that you wanna trade in, I would go ahead and do some research on that as well to see how much you can expect to receive for it. So when you do find a car that you're actually serious about buying, make sure you take it on a test drive. I would recommend bringing a family member or a friend along with you on that drive because they may find things that you didn't catch. And another thing that I would strongly recommend is to test drive that car during the traffic conditions that you normally experience on your day-to-day -day commute. So a few things to keep in mind here when you're negotiating the price of the car. You want to go ahead and do some research to see the average price that buyers are paying for the type of car that you want. You want to make sure that you make your opening offer way less than the maximum you're willing to pay for the car. And for my folks out there that cringe at the thought of negotiation, do not worry. There are some dealerships out there that have a no haggle policy. The price you see is the price you get. I really hope this video was helpful for you guys. If you have any car buying tips, please comment below. I'd love to hear what you have to say. And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and I'll catch you on the next how-to.